In this video we show you how to organise the applications on your Samsung Galaxy S3. Take your Galaxy S3 and make sure it's switched on. Click Apps and you'll see a list of all your applications on the device. You'll have a number of little bubbles at the bottom here that you can scroll through to show you which screen of apps you're on. Now depending upon your configuration will depend upon how they're displaying. But at this screen, if you click the menu button here, you have the option to organize your applications. So you can edit like so, and you can press, hold, and move applications about if you choose into your own desired order. You can click save or you can click cancel. You can click menu again and show only downloaded apps. You can click back, you can click menu again and change the view type so it could be your own customised, you can have it into alphabetical grid like so or if we go back into it and do it as an alphabetical list it then displays like so. So the choice is yours. Now depending upon the view type will depend upon the options that you have available. So I have now changed it to a list view and I don't have so many options so I can go to view type and if I go back to alphabetical grid and then click menu again I've got more options in terms of what I do with my applications. I can click uninstall if I choose and select which ones I wish to uninstall. I can go to the play store from the apps menu I can share specific apps by ticking each one and then sharing them via social networks. I can even hide applications if I choose. So there may be apps that I don't want kids to access if my kids were using my phone. So you literally press each one that you want to hide and then come back and then those apps will be hidden. And then if you had some hidden, you can tell it to actually show your hidden applications. And those are just some of the ways that you can organize your apps on the Samsung Galaxy S3.